Hey everyone, welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Mega Man 3 The Wily Wars. You know who was weak against Topspin? That guy. Shadow Man had one of the more interesting themes in the NES version of the game, and it's, um. It's recreated pretty well here. I definitely still prefer the NES version, but this is a pretty smooth version here. That's definitely the word I'd use to describe its transition to the Genesis game. It's very smooth. And here we have Proto Man yet again. Kinda wish he'd leave me alone, but what are you gonna do? His pattern is never really overly difficult. Usually, most of the stages he appears in, there's a way to get multiple hits on him in a very short time. Like this one, as long as you slide underneath him, he can't do anything, do you? These guys return from Magnet Man stage. And they are about as problematic here as they are there. Okay, well, that one actually hit me. That's upsetting. Here we have holograms there. They uh, replaced the level with star-filled, oh god, star-filled sky. Those grenade dudes explode when you kill them, so be careful about that. Make sure you kill them from a distance. You can use a uh, magnet missile here to get rid of those. In fact, I might just use some magnet missile for a while. I really doubt it's picking it up, but the magnets make some pretty interesting noises in this version of the game. Jeez, I'm doing really bad following my own advice about dodging those explosions there. Alright, that's whatever. Of course, taking advantage of the weapon to shoot through floors is perfectly acceptable, I'd say. Oh, come on! Unresponsive jump button for the lose! Ah, uh, you know what? It's one thing to die to stupid mistakes, it's another thing to die because your controller doesn't feel like responding. I'm like, jump, Mega Man! Mega Man's like, what now? Yeah. Ah, uh, now I'm taking stupid hits. Whoa. I'm taking more stupid hits just in the name of survival. Ah, some yambos just to make my day ever so complete. Ooh, energy. Ah! Okay. I got two lives here. Let's see how I do Buster only. I predict not well. Shadow Man has a pattern in that he doesn't have a pattern. He always begins with... He will always begin the fight with two jumps, and then he'll either dash or throw shurikens. Then he'll jump three times and either dash and or throw shurikens. And I can't count to three, apparently. Three... <sighs> Top spin, we. Oh yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like busting, uh, dueling him to the death. Let's do it. Oh, in your face, Shadow Man! One of my favorite robot masters and an enjoyable stage. Mm -hmm. 
Rush Marine, incredibly useless as he is. I eh, will use him once or twice. More than likely, more along the lines of the once, but... Yeah. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next episode.